So, now that we've done that, I guess it's safe to say that we can enter the first level of the story mode. So, without further ado, <laughs> with further ado, yeah, right. Without further ado, let's begin. Behold. Now, each of these blocks is basically a different stage in this world, which is page one in the beginning, and a different difficulty. I'm probably going to do everything in the difficulty orders, so, of course, we'll begin with the easiest, level one, treasure hunt. It's time to reveal the lucky fruit. What will it be, ladies and gentlemen? Okay, now we get to select our adorable Yoshi. There are six of them right now, but there's a rumor that there might actually be some hidden. We better keep our eyes peeled for the rare Yoshis in the wild. Right now, we'll start with our favorite green. Time to get going, little buddy. And right off the bat, apple. Okay, but not my favorite. And here is an evil shy guy. Come to steal our happiness, but we won't let him. We'll eat him, and that solves everything. <laughs> so cute. All right. It's really nice that there's just fruit all over the ground. Seems like Baby Bowser wasn't very careful when he was dragging that tree through here. I wonder if the treasure hunt mostly meant fruit in bubbles? I mean... Oh, here's a fun fact. If you eat today's lucky fruit, you'll earn a whopping eight hearts. One more thing. Do a ground pound near a shy guy while you're super happy. I think they're giving us a little tip there, but I think we already explored that in practice. Right now, I'm not super happy. I'm happy enough, though. And you, sir, put that banana down. Thank you. So, I can change the color of the Shy Guy's robes by ground pounding, and I usually change it to green while I am green. That also fills up my eggs. Handy. Man, not only can these fruit be found in bubbles, I mean, talk about your soap, so fruit, soap, whatever, but it can just be found floating in the air. I mean, who cares about physics? This is a pop up book, I guess. Alright, mister, turn green for me, please. Thank you. Yoshi's going green. Because he is green. I don't see how he could go green anymore. And since I swallowed that one yellow shy guy, I've got one yellow egg. It's kind of cool that the spots change the color of whatever you eat. Okay. You can press start to pause. You'll see Yoshi's mood and much more. Lucky fruit and favorite fruit are shown, along with any special hearts that you find. So as you can see, lucky fruit banana, favorite fruit for this Yoshi is the watermelon. We're doing pretty good, and we haven't found any special hearts, and... Oh no, there's a fork in the road. And they're both yellow, so which one are we supposed to follow? I guess it doesn't really matter in this case. Ha! <laughs> gotcha! Which was mine anyway, so... I guess it doesn't matter. I'm not really stealing. Yay! And this... kid is napping in the middle of the road. There's a kid napping in the middle of the road! Okay, let's figure this out. Nap time? There are four Miss Warps in each course. Find them and wake them up! If other Warps are awake, jump on one to warp to another. When a Yoshi is lost, you'll start from the highest number Warp you have reached. So, I guess it'll be useful to wake it up! Wake up Miss Warp and her sisters to skip between them. Oh, sounds like a little baby. Okay, Miss Warp, you can hop up and down all you want, but we've got some fruit to find. And who is this guy? Packy Derm. Packy won't let you buy unless you give something special a try. Nice little rhyme. Okay, let's try something special. Look how high I can jump! What? There's an invisible wall! Ugh, very high. Man, these Packy Derm guys are pretty powerful. Their fashion statement isn't, but... Let's see. I can't eat it. Smelling isn't anything special. It probably doesn't smell too special anyway. And I guess the only thing left to do is... <laughs> there. If anything's in your way, kids, pound the ground, and that'll usually solve it. Okay. Surprise ball. You can't eat it, but if you use your tongue, you'll be surprised. Okay. I'll use my tongue. Surprise me. Woo! Flips! 
Yes, she can do acrobatics. Whoa. Okay, things just pop out of thin air. That's normal. And tasty. There's more fragile sky warning again. We better watch it. Hello, shy guy. Thank you for your contribution to eggs. I mean, eggs are a great contribution. And of course, we don't really need that right now. But just to get Yoshi happy, we'll do that. I love hearing his cute little voice when he's happy. Okay, watermelon time. Follow the coins and... Whoa, that was a nasty fall. But Yoshis are just fine. Okay. Melon race. Hit the question block and cross the starting line to begin the race. The faster you go, the more melons you'll win at the goal line. Okay, that sounds good to me. Let's start! Oh great, a chomp. He doesn't look too keen on uh, letting us win too many melons. Uh, these shy guys aren't making things easy either. I mean, when did shy guys make things easy? Okay, get out of the way, Pachyderm! Can't stop! I don't know why they think it's so important to stop anyone. But oh well. Seven melons! Whoa. Nice lucky too. We knew we could fit that many in his cloud. Okay, here we go. Our heart fruit. Super happy time. Alright, that was a coin letter. I think you can find more of those in other areas and levels. They might even spell out a secret message from Yoshi if I remember right. Okay. You are now a banana. I hope you feel the appeal. <laughs> okay. So anyway. That was that. I mean, you don't want to mess with Super Happy Yoshi. He's stronger and cuter than Superman when he is super happy. Okay, the magic vase. Hop on top and push down on the control stick. Here we go. Wait, is Mario in there? Here we go. Let's see. Here we go. Okay, the game's over. Whoa. Okay, the page turned and we got dumped in the middle of nowhere. Oh well, might as well sing and dance. Yeah, she's so optimistic. Oh, floating apple. Nice. Okay. Oh, hello there, little guy. If you guys played Yoshi's Island, you'll remember who he is. But, just in case you haven't. Hello, Poochie. Poochie will gladly show you the way. He often stops to sniff a secret. Okay. We need secrets. So go sniff them out, boy. Good boy. Follow that Pooch. Seems like he's sensing something right here. And I pressed the wrong button constantly. Come on, sniff, Yoshi, sniff. I got it right before, why am I wasting my eggs? There we go. Sorry for the momentary derp out. Here we go. And we only need five more fruits. Oh, hey, shy guys, stop. I mean, you are supposed to be shy, wasn't that in your description? Why are you running at me aggressively? All right. More melons that just come out of the ground whenever we sniff. And pound the ground, of course. Because pounding the ground solves everything. I'm guessing that this is one of the special hearts. Although I guess I'm not really guessing. I know it is! Have a heart! Find the special hearts to open other courses on the next page. Three hearts are hidden in each course. Listen for ringing chimes when one is near. Pause your game to see how many hearts you've found so far. You guys want to have a heart? Listen for ringing chimes works every time. I don't know why I'm wasting my time doing that. Poochie will sniff things out. <laughs> Priceless. <laughs> do their little dance. I'm gonna kind of wait on some of these fruits because I do want to find all the special hearts. Although we probably don't need to since we'll only be needing to go to level one anyway. Mm -hmm. What is it, boy? Mm -hmm. Is Jimmy in the well? Mm -hmm. Well, there's no well around. Mm -hmm. Alright, melon, but I can see another heart, and I can hear it too. We'll come back to these tasty treats a little later. Convenient platform. There we go. Okay, so we've got two, only one more to find. Alright, Yoshi, what is it? You know that plant there kind of looks like an open book? I don't know if that's just my divergent thinking, or if that was intentional. These are all kind of cut out, so I guess. Oh no, more not shy shy guys! Who knew if Yoshi shot things he became twice as happy, I mean... Come on, that's a little... I mean, I would have thought that he would be happier after eating, but... Oh well. Just throw eggs! You have egg on your face now. Okay. Nice. 
These points are racking up. What are they yelling about anyway? You can hear them kind of... Hey, I own this road just as much as you do. In fact, I don't recall this being your island. I mean, it says in... Well, maybe not in this game, but it says in other games, this is Yoshi's Island. But I don't want to discriminate against Shy Guys. I mean, I guess if you're okay, you can stay here. I mean, this island is kind of for everybody, but you can't go discriminating against me by chasing me off the road. Otherwise, you'll get egg in your face. And you might get to have a nice inside, in-depth tour of my stomach. Just in case you're interested. Oh, and the inside of an egg, I guess. That's the next stop. So, there's a floating block. Wonder what this is about. Oh, I didn't get on the sweet spot. There we go. Okay, Yoshi. Yes! The last special heart. So now we've unlocked all the levels on the next page. Which is nice to know. I guess I'll keep going to the end for a little bit here. Good job, Poochie. Boy, you can run. And there's the last missed warp. So, this looks like the end of the road to me. I'm pretty sure that if we go in this phase, we'll just go to the beginning because the level doesn't end till we finish eating. So thanks for all your help, Poochie. And thank you, Miss Warp. You take good care of me. Alright. I suppose we'll go put this down. And that was the wrong button. And here we go! Happy as can be. It's good to have a super happy heart with Yoshi. Yoshi! Yoshi! I wasn't really trying there, but oh well. Here we go. Yoshi's mood for page one, the beginning. Pretty good. See that heartbeat? Very nice. And of course, this is a new game, so we naturally set that as our best. Hearts raining from the sky! Whoa. And so the adventure began. The Yoshi set out to find the super happy tree. Poochie the dog help, helped out. Not even elephants could stop the Yoshis. No way. We're unstoppable. So far, so good. If they could stay happy, the tree would be saved. That's right, guys. Keep happy. You'll find your super happy tree. The page turned, and the Yoshis grew happier. That's so nice. All right. What awaits us on the next happy page of this land? Uh, doesn't look too happy to me. Let's see, we've got a bone dragon pit, and a lot of other unpleasant things. It's not my idea of a vacation. But, I guess, if we're gonna find that tree, we've gotta go through some places like this. The road to happiness is not always pleasant. So, I guess that will be saved for our next episode. So, I hope you guys enjoyed, and thank you so much for watching. So, please do tune in next time if you want to see what happens next. Will the Yoshi save the super happy tree and set the island free, or will Baby Bowser rule? Find out next time. See y'all later, guys. Bye!